starting the game and playing with you know, some, some of the first offense, was that a different experience? And then, and then secondly, just, you know, how did you get up for you? Definitely a different experience. It was awesome to be out there with, with some of the starters, um, playing against some defensive starters as well in a rowdy environment here in Minnesota. So it was great experience, uh, first start. Obviously, would want things to go a little bit differently uh, the, than the way that they did. You know, we were, we were able to sustain some solid drives there, um, get it down to the red zone. Obviously, got to eliminate the turnovers, um, regardless of situation, and continue to, to you know move the ball and be able to convert in the red zone. Uh, I guess so. Uh, there's some positive in that, right? Um, no, I obviously got to gotta watch the film and, and kind of see what happened. Um, but, yeah. On, on that first interception, it looked like the ball got tipped. Did you, did you have any sense of it? I don't know. I don't know. Maybe throw high or just leave? I don't know. I, I do know that the guy had his hand up. It looked, I don't. I, I couldn't tell you. I got to go back and watch it. I don't want to. I'm not. I'm not going to make excuses for it as well. So. When you go back and watch the film, what are you going to be looking for? Uh, I think just everything, you know, um, as I would if if I had a good game, and uh, just evaluate myself, learn, get better, continue to push forward. You know, I understand mistakes are supposed to happen as a rookie, um, and there's not a lot of rookies that get the opportunity to be able to start a preseason game. So I'm just thankful for the opportunity. As Frank this, um, you always, the, the goal is put it in the end zone. You guys didn't get a touchdown tonight. How much does that kind of, you know, sort of resonate with you? Yeah, it's tough. It's tough. You got to be, if you want to be a really successful team, you got to be great in the red zone. And it's something that we work on all the time. We talk about all the time. Uh, we got to be better in that area uh, to be able to, you know, Six points is a lot better than three. And Frank said, you know, we asked Frank, like, do you know where you stand with making a decision moving forward? I know it's not up to you, but he says he may need to see more. You know, what do you think it's going to take for somebody to step up and take this? That's a great question. Um, you know, I, I think we're both such young guys. Um, we're trying to develop ourselves and, and learn as much as possible. I know that. That's up to coach and his decision. I know both of us are just focused on, you know, we understand this is a marathon, not a sprint. And um, hopefully we both are able to have long careers and this is just a small step in that, in that journey. So just focused on every day, getting better and continue to develop. You talked about the moment not getting too big and not letting that, but is it hard when, when you're in the middle of the quarterback competition and you can start your first game? I mean, there's a, there's a lot going on, especially this week. Definitely, um, but that's why you play the game, right? It's, it's a lot. Um, but that's where that's where you got to excel if you want if you want to be um, what everybody dreams of being. You know, I think the the pressure and the competition is is something that should make you play better and um, hopefully helps you develop and and be able to come out and and be a better player from it. And I think that's what we're both helping each other do, pushing each other every day.